Hi, I'm Asif Ali Rahman with a background in business administration and a PhD from education. I bring a unique mix of competencies to the post-secondary education system. Human resource development is my area of expertise and training and development, my area of research. Developing strategies for the successful transfer of knowledge, skills, and attitudes from a training and development program to the workplace remains a key challenge facing organizations, including those operating in developing countries, such as Pakistan. Studies have found that in general, employees transfer less than 10% of the training they acquire to their workplaces. Although some research relating to the transfer problem in organizations do exist in developed countries, there appears to be a paucity of such research in developing countries such as Pakistan, and thus the rationale for this study. The purpose of this mixed method study was to investigate the degree to which the media industry of Pakistan delivered training programs that facilitated the transfer of training before, during, and after training, and the way the relationship among these three activities influenced transfer of training in the industry. Using a convergent mixed methods design, the study utilized survey questionnaires and semi-structured interviews with the 16 employees of the eight media organizations in Lahore, Pakistan. The survey questionnaire sought to explore the training characteristics and contextual factors that influenced transfer of training before, during, and after training, as well as participants' suggestions to foster transfer of training. The findings revealed the training characteristics as well as contextual factors positively or negatively influenced transfer of training before, during, and after training. 11 themes emerged from participants' interviews and they generally reinforced the survey findings. It was the conclusion of this study that in addition to training characteristics and contextual factors, productive networking among trainees before, during, and after training was a critical factor in the successful transfer of training in studied organizations. The study concluded with some discussion of the implications of the findings for policy, practice, and theory development for transfer of training. Thank you.